What's going on, guys? This is Liftoff Gaming, and I am doing a video on the underrated commentators little series that that iPod King Carter has put up on his channel. And right before I start, I want to say I really appreciate what iPod King Carter is doing here and what he's doing for the YouTube community. So. Thanks, iPod King Carter, and let's go ahead and get started with the commentary. You see that I'm doing a online NCAA football 12 game against the Oklahoma City. Uh, why did I say Oklahoma City Thunder? But uh, the Oklahoma Sooners, who are number one, and then I'm I'm Florida State. I like to play with Florida State in most of my online games. They're just I don't know. Their quarterback can can run. He can pass. He's got the all around good package and. Usually what I'll do is I'll run in the pistol, pistol formation, as you see right there. And that's really what I run all game long unless I'm in inside the 10-yard 10, 10 line in the red zone. And I'll go ahead and do a, a goal line formation, but this was just plain lucky. I shouldn't have thrown that right there, but oh well. So I guess we can go ahead and talk about some internet news. If you know who Copper Cab is, Copper Cab... He his channel got hacked. He's the ginger who said whatever he said uh, gingers do have souls or whatever on that video that just exploded and got millions and millions uh, millions and millions of views. Oh yeah, that was lucky. That was a lucky pass too. I saw that guy sitting on it the whole time, just lucky pass. And this is where my luck changes, guys. My luck changes. This is the only pick of the game. And that sucked. It was inside the 10-yard line. I was about to score. I could have at least had a field goal. But oh well. And then going back to Copper Cab. Yeah, his channel got hacked by some guy. He was... What I've heard is from the... From some video that uh, Copper Cab was visiting Oregon or some, some college. And he was using the internet at some internet cafe or whatever. And one of the students... Got on to got onto his account or whatever, cause he didn't log out or something, and he hacked it. So, and he changed the password and everything. But ooh, nice fumble there. I got pretty lucky also, and got the ball right back. But um, yeah, he stole his password. I mean, he didn't steal. He changed his password, and now he's making videos. He made a video on it asking if he should delete the channel or keep it and just give it right back to him. But I really don't know. I'm. I don't really know what to stand. How to stand on, on this one? I mean, he's kind of annoying, but at the same time, he's kind of funny. I mean, it's it's weird. Like, I don't know. You'll laugh, but at the same time, you're like, dude, this guy's annoying. He should stop making videos. But I don't know. For the sake of YouTube, I say yes. Just give him back his channel. I mean, it's kind of kind of wrong and stuff. I mean, people should be able to make make videos on their channel. Have the right to do that. So, I don't know. We'll see what happens, but you see I got a touchdown on that fullback dive on the goal with that goal line offense. And yeah, nice pass there by, by my opponent who is controlling Oklahoma another nice screen there. Nice screen. I like screens. They're pretty I mean, they're high percentage passes, and they can they can get you a lot of yardage on on NCAA 12. But yeah, I I, I guess I could talk about my channel since you know I'm not going to be really uploading this to my channel. I'm just doing this for iPod King Carter's underrated commentator and stuff. And I do Road to Glory videos. I do my player videos for NBA 2K11 and association videos for NBA 2K11. What else do I do? I do Call of Duty, but, I mean, that's really it, and just, you know, strictly gaming and stuff, but, yeah, hopefully, you guys, hopefully, I mean, I'd really like it, like for you guys to at least check out my channel. My channel will probably be in the description, I'm, I'm not sure, I'm not sure how this is going to be uploaded to YouTube, but, ooh, sexy spin by the running back there on the HP draw. And I love to do the HP draw, especially like if I've passed a lot. I'll just do the HP draw and get the opponent so frustrated. But yeah, he's, you saw that he probably yeah he scored a field goal like 49 or 40 some like high 40, like 48 or something yard field goal or something like that. 
And you see I changed the play here, get it to triangle. Ooh, got hit pretty bad there. Nice open field tackle by the DB. And this like, this guy that I was versing, he could not get the ball off at the right time. Like, like if I sent a corner blitz on uh, on him, he he couldn't get the ball off in time. And he, he just couldn't do it. But this was a nice play, nice toss there. Got a lot of yardage, but... Like, if I sent a corner blitz, nine times out of ten, I'd sack him. So, I don't know why I didn't do that a lot of the time. I was just trying to be conservative and not, like, give up some huge play. Which I know can happen sometimes, but... Uh, yeah, let's see here. First play of the fourth quarter. We're up by two touchdowns. Not two. Wait, ooh, but you see, I bring in the corners. And as I said, nine times out of ten, I'm going to get that sack. But, uh, ooh, ooh, rolling out to the right, a nice, I mean, he was wide open, nobody was in miles of that dude, and then a fumble on another corner blitz, I don't know why my right in, I don't know what happened, but I, I dived there, but I end this game off pretty classy with a QB kneel, and thanks for watching, guys, again, I really appreciate iPod King Carter for, for you doing this for everybody, but, yeah, I'll see y'all later, and... Yeah, that's it. Peace.